the oh. There we go. No idea where the hell the uh, shotgun came from, though. That's not too bad. I get two shells. Oh, I was hoping that would kill them both. I did not kill them. Either of them. God, they're very red. Are you kidding? Boink. It's definitely a better gun, but my god, does it have. Who is that? I have no idea. Yeah, it's got some very, uh. It's got a low ammo count and it can't carry anything. Are there enemies here? No. I was like, why is it not letting me pick it up? Why is it not letting Oh, is it because it's the blue disc? Ah, uh, that's why. So Nazar, a glass eye. Oriental sacredly believe that eyes are the window to the soul. They can see both good and evil, and as a result, they can protect you from a curse. Most likely, the peculiar honouring of a glass eye finds its roots in the pre-Islamic past of Turkish culture. Okay. I can go down here. Ooh. Oh, crap. Oh, I got hit by it. Damn it. Nothing of it. Ooh, never mind. Wahoo. They're crypting. The night will be over and the day will... And the day when the god of evil, Araman, withdraws his forces from the last fight, will arrive. What? Oh. Cain. It's an orth orthopedic tool which provides additional support while walking. Cool. I don't like those things. I don't really understand them. What their purpose is, if anything. What's going to show up next? The Cy Cyborg. I nearly called it Cyclops. Here he goes. I thought it caused some snakes to spawn behind me. Oh, whoops. Oh, there are snakes behind me. No fucking wonder. Uh. Yeah, no wonder I could hear them. Jesus. Alright, well, I'm nearly dead. Cool. But I have some health. Thingies. We got him. I'm very low on health though. That's a lot of bones. Health would be greatly appreciated. Oh wait, I think that might be health. It's not. Well, shoot. They're not even close. Ooh. What the hell is this, uh... The tongue is sharper than a two-edged sword. I think I'd prefer to have a sharp sword, though. As opposed to a sharp tongue. Whoa! Oh dear! Oh boy. Oh god. I'm dead. I'm probably supposed to run this way. Ooh. I'm dead. And dead. I like how I just look up to the sky. <laughs> I took way too much damage from the snakes. Yeah, because I got hit by all three at once, which was three times the poison. I was just boned from that point onwards. Oh my god, am I all the way at the beginning again? No. Yes. Maybe. 
Very well could be. Oh yeah, I definitely am. My god, are you kidding? That sucks. Hey, whatever. Mm-hmm. Then we have this. Awesome. No, no, we are. We're right around the corner. Okay. I probably should have kept the pistol, to be honest. Nice. There we got it. Health. I didn't need health, but we got it. Hooray! Alright, that could have been worse. I have full health at least. Now I'm just doing the same as what I did before. I have 17 bullets. Oh! A lot more. Tongue is sharper than two-edged sword, yep. Oh, this is not where I need to be. Ew. Here I thought it was. Oh my god, that's so many snakes. There's no way. Yeah, I was about to say, there's no way. What the fuck? I think I might as well just go to the left. Follow that person. That way there's just so much stuff that spawns. It seems like you're supposed to just die. Can I even follow them though? I mean, I can see them. Whoa. Whoa, what? Uh, they reappeared and started to t -pose. Oh, I was... Me going the other way literally just led to those things I could decrypt. I'm guessing. The actual way I should go is this way. Well, who would have thought? I love how his model appeared. Just T-posing. Great. There they are! Are you serious? Oh. What? Oh, crows. Oh. Oh, yeah, whatever. Fuck the crows. If I can get to the next checkpoint before I die, then I'm, I'm happy. Oh. Oh, am I supposed to go all the way around now? Probably. Although I've got crows on me, which is never a good thing. I'm probably going to die before I even get over there. can't hit the fucking crows. They are impossible. And I also can't run because I keep getting hit by them. Can they just leave me alone? No, I'm gonna die. Because I can't deal with crows. Alright, I got it. Hooray! I'm very nearly dead though. Oh my god, are you kidding? I can't see it. Where's the crow? I fucking wish I knew. Wow, I just missed. <laughs> no, I was trying to hit the explosive to kind of kill it. 
I know I'm gonna die. Is the crow gonna kill me? Probably. Yeah, so now we over when blah blah blah. There we are. I expired. I'm so confused. I really do not like the crows. They are impossible to hit. Whether it's with a gun or a weapon, they're not easy to hit. They honestly shouldn't exist in the game. Hmm. The fact they do just makes it very, very annoying. I don't know where they come from though. This is where we have the, th the two snakes. Yeah, yeah, I got them both. Oh my god, are you kidding? Oh, now I can see them. Oh. I think I got him. Hope so. Now I understand. Right, and this is where he is. There you go, going over. So now I think I have to go all the way back. Really hurt there's a checkpoint soon. As I just realised that my uh, UI wasn't showing. Yeah. Hmm. No, I'm hoping there's a checkpoint so I'd have to redo all this. I now understand where the crows went. Straight up into the sky. <laughs> what a load of crap. That's where I came from. I don't think I need to do this every time, but whatever. I'm going to. <laughs> the night will be over when blah blah blue. There's the cane. So do not trust that guy. Eh, just something about him. Oh. Oh yay. Are you kidding? Oh, wow. Did I kill them? Oh my god, I did. Incredible! Okay, so this time, what has changed? I don't know. Maybe I can go straight across this time? Maybe? I don't bloody know. I know to go, oh, going to the dead end is a bad idea. Putting a sharp gun to a sword. Yeah, maybe we can go straight across now. Or oh, something. Or is there, is there an alleyway over here? Uh, there is. That's a dead end. Oh, all I had to do was this. Whoops. Oh, there was health here too. Two things are health. Yes, yeah, bloody move. Be thine enemy an ant, see in him an elephant. Oh god. Oh, here's one of them. Are you serious? Oh my god. Oh god. Oh 
my. I just want to get rid of the snakes. I'm not really bothered about anything else. The fact these aren't going down in one go is really surprising though. Great. There we go, we got them all though. Are you fucking serious? This is just a little ridiculous. They are so red. Are they all- they're all alive! Oh boy. Did these die or what? I get the feeling they can't die. I mean, that's pretty convincing that they can't die. Oh, they can die. It just takes a fucking long time. Just how many bullets? Oh my. Bit ridiculous. Just a bit. Wow. How thrilling. It still isn't dead. This is so dumb. I can also see where I've slashed him. This is really stupid. Just fucking kill it, please. Thank you. God. All because I wanted to pick this up. Oh, it's a stim pack. Can I even find it? Okay. I can't pick this up anyway. I'm trying to, but... Even if I get the cursor directly on the little paper thing, it's not gonna let me pick it up. Alright, well that was a waste then. Alright, well whatever. Yay, text to encyclopedia. Oh. What? Okay. <gasps> oh! Nice, I have a sword. Oh, we're just fighting. Alright. Bring it, bitch. Easy enough. Okay. Woohoo! Aren't you s uh, shifty? I win. Oh! God, death by low frame rate again. Well, it is enough. I hope I defeated all the creatures of darkness. Damn, seriously? One more enemy? What? Draco boots Thurgo. What? There was a surprising image of the sky. It turns out that I am, as the, as the guard, <laughs> protecting the maiden, or a maiden tower, from an angry dragon. Dragon? Dragon? Well, I just caused a disaster over my... <laughs> What the hell just happened? Whoa! Oh my god, I'm speedy! Yeah, just run through all the zombies. No! <laughs> oh, why did you just barge through them? Oh, okay. That was weird. Yeah, death by low frame rates. It's happened a couple times. The game's not terribly optimized, but it's not great either. In terms of optimization, and also the story makes no sense. And neither does the dialogue, for a lot of the time. It's fine. The cheesy and bad dialogue is <laughs> what makes it enjoyable. So bad it's good, as uh, the saying goes. 8%. We're nearly there, I think. Reach the top of tower. 
Bonesy! Bonesy 2.0. Oh, oh! Quick cutie, oh! Cutie, eh? What am I pressing for this? RT! I love the QTEs because they're so easy. RT! Oh! <coughs> when I say they're so easy, I actually meant to say they're very difficult. I knew as soon as I said that I was going to fuck it up. <clears throat> well, the game sure showed me, eh? Ah, shoot. Wait, there we go. Let's tussle. So it's LT, RT, RT. I think. It's not going to change it up. RT. RT. There we go. Is that everything? Whoa, whoa, what the f- That looked... <laughs> so high def. Oh, he's on fire! Ooh, I cut him in half. How many of these are there? Oh, bollocks. Only downside with LT and RT looking so bloody similar. I kind of wish they made it so that LT would show up on the left side, and RT would show up on the right side. That's how they usually do uh, QTEs. At least when it comes to triggers. Although, to be fair, I'm speaking entirely of like, God of War. The QTEs in that game usually would show on the direction of the screen, like where the button is. If it's a face button, it would be at the bottom. RT again. I don't remember what's next. Was it RT or LT? LT! And I think it was RT again? I don't remember. RT! Yeah! LT! There we go. I thought we just thrusted him. Oh, there we go. I'm guessing I'm done. Hopefully. Yay! God, that was awkward. The young prince fell in love with the sleeping princess before rising to the top of this kingdom. It isn't translated. And entering the Vajras will meet, it isn't translated at an entrance. Okay. <laughs> is, it, is the entire boss fight going to be a QTE? Oh, that would be the best. Shut the door! There's so many zombies! I'm sure that thing's audio just repeated. I'm gonna deal with the dragon. I have a sh okay, my shotgun. Where even is the dragon? Oh, there he is. I'm ready. Locked and loaded. Yay! Shotgun actually does a surprising amount of damage. Ow. Don't mind me. Ah. Wait, I wonder if I can shoot it. Oh, I was hoping I could shoot it from that far away. That'd be the best. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Ooh. Whoa! My range is pretty good, though. Holy crap, the damage. I win! Too easy. <laughs> How did I slide on my knees? This is concrete. So what the hell is that noise? Did one of the zombies pick up a machine gun or something? <gasps> it's not over! Oh. <laughs> what? 
I congratulate you. You fulfilled the mission. You defeated all the powers of evil. It was me, the dragon, the main fighter of Arimon. Oh my god, this game what makes no you sense. You were risking your life. <sighs> you were in hell. Were watching into monsters' eyes. And what next? Who will learn about your act of bravery? And how did the god of good thank you? Did you return to your mother? Or is your blood back to you? Join me, and we'll manage the world of darkness together. Evil sprouts have lost in your soul long ago, so let them grow. Do I actually choose? The chosen by killing the dragon, you will completely destroy the evil. But the good cannot exist without Who's evil. talking to me now? Just like there is no light without darkness. You have executed your mission. Can that machine gun just stop? Imprison dragon, join evil. I like how I'm on an Xbox and it's giving me the PlayStation buttons. My god. <laughs> I prison it. Incredible. Dragon, you are not right. I don't need anyone's gratitude. By saving the world, I've been saving myself first of all. But what should I do with you? Stop the machine gun. Now the powers of good will grind the dragon back in a dungeon for one thousand years, and balance of the world will be restored. Whoa, my sausage fingers! Oh god, they really do look like hot dogs. Finally, the audio stopped being crap. Hooray, the machine gun stopped. There we go, back to normal. That is a very low quality building in the distance. Well, there we go. I have three words to say about this game. What. The. Fuck. <laughs> I understood zero of the story. The story made zero sense. Well, I have saved the world. And the dialogue made even less sense. I'm really small. Oh no! I'm the hero that nobody knew. <laughs> Look how small I am! And I just had to write the scenario. Well, there it is. Thank you for playing the game. Oh my! What an experience! Like I'm, God. I don't want to make this game out to be, re like, really good. The game is not good. The game is pretty bad. But, the absurdity of the story, it's incredibly short length. Like, it's only been two and a half hours. Um, and also, just dialogue that doesn't make sense. Kind of pushes it to becoming, to becoming a uh, bad but enjoyable game. <laughs> Weirdly enough. I can't believe the last or the choice you have to make at the end of the game and it gives you the PlayStation buttons. What would make that incredibly ironic is if on the PlayStation version of this it gives you the Xbox buttons. It just don't make sense because the Xbox buttons are on everything else in the game. It's just that last choice is the only thing where I saw PlayStation buttons. How weird. That game was kind of all over the place really. <laughs> It's just, just a bit. Like, the the dialogue... Just... I don't know, it, it just seemed like it wasn't... proofread. So that it actually made sense. It's just kind of like they mashed a bunch of words together. And called it a day. 
Um, yeah. And then you had the dialogue that was a mess. You have the subtitles that didn't even match up to said dialogue. Pretty much all the time. I can only count on, maybe count on one hand when the subtitles actually matched with what was being said. Every other time there was a word that was replaced or just not used. It's very weird. Which makes me think that the subtitles were what were made first and then the script changed, I guess. It's like the only idea I can think of. They wouldn't write a script and then have subtitles being like entirely different. Usually it'd be the other way around. They would have a script and then it would change by the end of end of the game. Or well, end of production, I guess. My god. But yeah. That wasn't terrible. It wasn't good. I need to say that. It wasn't very good. But just with how absurd the game was. Again, it's just it's Magus. Basically playing this is like playing Magus, but a a shooter, Magus, and not an RPG. Because Magus had the same sort of issues where every level was incredibly short, the game was incredibly short. Um the dialogue in the game was really weird. Not to this extent, I think this had worse dialogue. In terms of dialogue that made <sighs> no sense. I think Magus's problem was just the dialogue they used was like old old timey English. So it just didn't fit. By the way, that's the end of The Last Dead End. Again, an enjoyable game. If you want to play through a bad game, then yeah, i definitely recommend it. <laughs> Though I'd probably wait for sale because I don't know how much the game is. And it's only been two and a half hours and I failed a fair bit. So, it's not a super long game. <laughs> what an experience. Hot damn. Holy shit. Either way, <laughs> that is going to be the end of The Last Dead End. Thank you so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed this absurd ad adventure. And until next time, take care.